My name is Mike Ruma. I'm a maternal fetal medicine specialist. I work at Perinatal Associates in New Mexico. And what we're going to talk about today is the Epic and Affinity ultrasound platforms, the latest release of software, which incorporates a variety of new features. The EL184 linear pure wave transducer is a very impressing transducer to me. I've been amazingly impressed with the detail the black and white contrast, not only in the near field, but all the way throughout the far field, there's excellent penetration to the transducer. The image quality and the detail resolution is remarkable. Seeing skin outlines, bone outlines that are crystal clear and absolutely sharp is really amazing. You can make out an absolute exquisite facial profile. What I'm impressed with looking at this uh, EL184 image is just the crisp lines around uh, the skin edge, actually being able to visualize the nostril, exquisite representation of the upper and lower lip. You can see the tongue very easily here. The maxilla and mandible is present as well. I think you will uh, be impressed to see what it looks like uh, in your hands as well. What do you think about that profile? I can see the ear more. What do you think that little bit of anatomy is? The nose. Looks like the nose, right? You can make out a beautiful skin edge here. Mm -hmm. You can make out a nice nose, upper lip here. This is uh, the nasal bone, which is uh, very beautifully imaged here. EL184 helps us highlight the heart in an impressive way. What you can see in this image, which often is difficult to see, is a near field, far field contrast of the uh, cardiac silhouette. What I'm impressed with is the ability to see the myocardium in, in discrete contrast from the pericardial sac. You can easily see the actual foramen ovale opening and closing, the atrioventricular valves. We have the tricuspid and mitral valve here that look beautiful, and the interventricular septum. Moderator band is demonstrated to us, and, and overall, just an absolute crisp design and representation of the fetal cardiac structure. Another area where uh, the EL184 demonstrates some very strong prowess is evaluating digits. You can see the, the hands of the fetus here clearly representing five fingers. You can actually count the metacarpals present within the digits, things that we would not ever attempt to do with any other kind of transducer. We could potentially count fingers, but this is really remarkable uh, imaging. EL184 linear transducer uh, has the capacity to uh, use uh, microflow as well. And what you can see in this is a beautiful cord insertion into the placenta. Often difficult to see, but the low flow characteristics and capacity of looking for low flow perfusion is really the high point of the EL184 with microflow technology. Just able to come up with some beautiful imaging of the placental cord insertion. This probe has a significant future in obstetrics, I think it has a significant future in maternal fetal medicine. When we look at areas where we might particularly want to use this probe, in personal usage, it has helped me identify nuchal translucencies in difficult scenarios where previous I could not identify the nuchal translucency at all. In cardiac abnormalities, in heart cases when there uh, are problems, delineating the underlying cardiac diagnosis is likely going to be much easier uh, with this type of probe.